And shortly after, the president requested for the approval of 500 billion naira from the House of Representatives. President Bola Tinubu is now telling Nigerians that the framework for palliatives to remedy the effects of fuel subsidy removal is being worked out. And he gave a strong assurance that the decision was in the best interest of a country, especially in guaranteeing future prosperity. He made this statement when he welcomed a group of governors elected in 1999, at the same time he was also elected as governor of Lagos State. Now, during the president's interaction with the, the former governors, who were his colleagues at the start of the Fourth Republic, he talked about the challenges of governance and the determination of his administration to provide leadership that will bring rapid growth and development. All hands must be on deck to give Mr. President the needed support and encouragement to foster a better country, a better nation. We also seize the opportunity to congratulate him as the new chairman of ECOWAS and assure him that we are with him. And any time he wants to dig into the wealth of experience of this very prominent and well-founded members of class of 99, he should be rest assured that we'll continue to give him the necessary support. On this part, Mr. President assured us that it is his dream to see a better Nigeria. And he wants us to also let you know that the decisions that he has taken so far might be painful, but it's just like a child belt. In order to celebrate a child, you must go through labor. Therefore, Nigerians should be wait patiently and believe in him that he's going to come up with palliatives that will put smile on the faces of every one of us in Nigeria.